Welcome to InThisCornerTV.com, sponsored by Tecate, Cerveza Con Caracter. I'm Smitty. We're at the MGM Grand Saturday night. A really good matchup. It's veteran former world champion Rafael Marquez taking on unbeaten Juan Manuel Lopez. We spoke to both fighters. Tell us about your uh, preparation for this fight with uh, Rafael Marquez. Hablando de tu preparación para esta pelea. Una, una gran preparación, una de las mejores preparaciones que he tenido en toda mi vida. Día a día se aprende algo nuevo y estamos trabajando bien fuerte para esta pelea. It's a great preparation, you know, you're always learning something in the gym. Uh, and it's been great, you know, had a great training camp. You're unbeaten. Yeah, you've shown a lot of uh, speed, a lot of power. You're a complete fighter. What are the things you're mainly working on to improve as a fighter? Obviamente eres un peleador que ya tiene todo, ¿no? Un peleador muy completo. ¿Qué se necesita para mejor, ir mejorando? No, peleas grandes como son estas. Peleas donde le podemos demostrar al público que estamos donde estamos porque no le hemos ganado, no porque es pura casualidad. You know, at this point of my career, I think it's just a, a get fight, getting fights, big fights, and beating big names, so everybody knows that I belong in the same level as some of these great fighters. Well, this is a, I think, a big fight on on Saturday night. Uh, Marquez, in my opinion, uh, is clearly the best fighter you faced. Do you think he'll be the toughest fighter you faced? Obviamente, yo pienso por la experiencia y todo que es el mejor peleador que te has enfrentado. ¿Tú sientes lo igual? No, claro que sí, pero En los papeles decía que los Yankees iban a ganar y perdieron, así que, que según los papeles el peleo es más difícil, pero tal vez sea el más fácil, esa habría que esperar que suene la campana. You know, on paper it looks like that, but you never thought the Yankees were going to win the World Series too. So, you know, you know, you can't count on anything. You know, on paper, you know, it should, it should be a tough fight, but sometimes they're not. Going up in, in weight, how has your training uh, been for this? Dice, tú tienes una, una historia de 15 años de pelea, De, de boxeador, ¿cómo te sientes para esta pelea? ¿Qué es lo que deseas para esto? Bueno, este, vengo bien preparado para, para dar un gran espectáculo a toda la gente. Creo que eh, tengo tengo bastantes bastantes peleas. Well, are you feeling much better? I training for this and I I train very hard because I want to give you a good good show to the people. That's what I expect them to do. You started at a at a buck 18. It's only eight more pounds, but a lot of people don't realize those eight pounds can can make a big difference to some guys like a Manny Pacquiao. It doesn't, but is the eight pounds much of a difference? Creo que creo que me siento más fuerte que anteriormente. Creo que este es este es el peso ideal, el peso ideal de de, de para pelear. Y creo que me siento fuertísimo que anteriormente. I feel I'm very very strong for this fight. There's a lot of people for. Possible, they don't uh, believe it, but I, I believe I train, I train harder for this fight. You know, his his brother has uh, gone up in in weight. Has his brother given him any any recommendation, any tips for going up in weight and keeping all the the, the power and the speed? Dice tu hermano, si te advirtió algunas cosas para esta pelea, porque él es un muchacho que es más alto que tú, más fuerte que tú, en el sentido, en el sentido de, del peso. Sí, dice no no. Sí, me dio unos tips para 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 igual para poder peleado con zurdos y creo que me dio unos tips para 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 poder este descifrar la pelea, ¿no? So yes, yes, he told me some something you to fight with the South Pole. I believe they give me some tips to to be in the South Pole, guys. Well, you break down Lopez versus Marquez. How do you see the fight going? Hablando de la pelea, ¿qué es lo que tú esperas de la pelea? Una pelea fuerte, que él va a venir a poner presión durante todo el tiempo. Nosotros vamos a hacer, a hacer nuestra pelea más distancia inteligente y, y a dominarlo round por round. I think he's going to come right at me. He's going to put a lot of pressure on me. So I got to keep my distance, be smart, be intelligent, be fast, and just move, you know, box him. How psyched up. We've got Puerto Rico and Mexico again. How psyched up is uh, Puerto Rico over this fight? La, la guerra de Puerto Rico en Gran México, una... Es algo ya tradicional, en realidad, pero yo no, no me voy a dejar llevar por eso, voy a hacer mi trabajo sin presión alguna. I know it's a great tradition, you know, a lot of expectations when they, you know, when Mexico and Puerto Rico fight, but I'm not going to get into that, I just want to, you know, give the fans a great fight. Over the last three years, four of your last five fights have been against the same man in Vasquez. How, how does that affect you as you go against a guy, obviously a bigger guy with a completely different style? ¿Cómo es posible, por ejemplo, después de que has peleado las cuatro veces con Israel, ahora vas a pelear con un hombre que está arriba del peso, que es el pluma? 
¿Cómo crees que te pueda afectar o hacer en el futuro? Yo digo que no, que no me afecta. Yo digo simplemente que, que este, yo ya tengo dos peleas que, que hice en, en, en este peso, en peso pluma, y creo que no, no me va a afectar para nada. Creo que todo lo contrario. Creo que me siento muy bien, muy bien, más fuerte que anteriormente. Me siento. No me afecta nada ahora. I believe I feel the strong, I feel the confidence, and I train harder for the, the, the fight. You're certainly the most experienced guy he's ever faced, the best fighter he's ever faced. What's your game plan on Saturday night against Juanma? ¿Cuál es tu plan para poder ganarle a Juan Mar el, el sábado? El estilo, eh, pegarle, entrar o salir. Claro que sí. Yo digo que las peleas se ganan este, inteligentemente, pensando, y creo que se ganan igual tirando golpes. No, tú, tú con una buena condición que tengas, creo que creo que es factible para para tirar golpes y, y este y ganar la pelea, ¿no? I believe that you have to use your intelligence in the ring, you know, before anything else. If you're intelligent uh, to fight to the guys like him, you're beating. I know I want to beat him. What's his prediction? ¿Cuál es tu predicción para ganar? Este, va a haber knockout. I want to knock him out. He just sat here and told me he's predicting not a decision, a knockout. Él acaba de pronosticar un knockout. Definitivamente no se va a hacer la pelea de Rambo Ramos, este, no tenemos prisa por buscar el knockout, pero si viene no, no lo vamos a desaprovechar. You know, we're gonna, you know, keep our, uh, our game plan. If the knockout comes, it'll come and we'll be ready for it. All right, uh, best of luck on, on Saturday night and continued success. Mucho éxito y mucha suerte. El... No, y muchas gracias a ustedes por el apoyo y al público que está pendiente de hacer una gran pelea. Well, thank you for all the support, all the fans that are watching this, and, uh, you know, give them a great fight Saturday. I really like this matchup on a Saturday night. You have the veteran Marquez going up in weight, taking on the unbeaten youngster in Lopez. You got uh, Mexico versus Puerto Rico. All the ingredients that should make for a great matchup. I think that the youth and perhaps the uh, power and size of Lopez will be a little bit too much for Marquez. I look for Lopez to break Rafael down and stop him late in the fight. But you can guarantee this, it will be a great fight uh, all the way till the end. Be sure and stay tuned in this corner TV.com for post-fight coverage. I'm Smitty.